Hello, welcome to our Sao Wireless News. I'm Roberta Press, Cut Latin America correspondent, and I've been doing a series of stories regarding Rio Olympics. And I'm here with Leticia Mazon. She is a spokeswoman at Uber, who did a lot of promotions for the games. Give me a heads up about what is it. Well, what we're here today with Visa letting people know is our real pool stunt. Um, so in real pool, real pool um, users will be able to call a special car. This car might come with a, a former or current um, Olympics athlete, or this car um, will always come with a, with a series of cameras where users can, can um, do a, a series of special videos, Olympics-themed videos, and they'll get these videos on their Facebook Messenger afterwards so this is the idea with this is to incentivize the usage of uber pool here in Rio uber pool is an ideal um, service for people who want to get around Rio um, in a reliable and accessible way during the Olympics because there are a lot of people coming and going from the same places so it would make sense to put more people in less cars and uh, what does Uber expect from the Olympics in terms of increasing the Uber pool or there are no more Uber or Uber Black? So, um, first and foremost, we expect um, to move Rio, move these visitors, these athletes and these locals in a reliable and accessible way. Um, that's always Uber's focus, is on users, is on getting people from point A to point B in the most seamless way possible. So besides Uber Pool, here in Rio we have, for instance, a, a partnership with iPass where people have over 1,300 free Wi-Fi points in the city where they can call their Uber from. Um, we have a lounge at Santos Dumont Airport. We have a, an Uber pool lounge and a 10 minute walk from the Olympic um, Park. So it's about getting people from point A to point B in the most seamless way possible and helping the Rio infrastructure on mobility. How many cars does Uber has, uh, right now in Brazil, have right now in Brazil? We have over 10,000 um, partners in Brazil. And I'm aware the goal is really higher than this. How does Uber plan to achieve this goal? So what we see is that there are a lot of people that want that income opportunity at the touch of a button in Brazil. Um, our goal for is to reach um, 50, over 50,000 partners in Brazil in October. And we're working to it. Thank you a lot for this interview. Thank you. Thanks. Stay tuned at arsawireless.com.